Hey family, so today was another successful day. Uh, I had an emergency uh, appointment with the doctor to for an examination. There's an, another swelling here that is really painful. Uh, so they've booked for a minor surgery. It's just a minor incision, it's not serious. And uh, thank you guys, yesterday we met uh, Kevin during our live session and it was so inspiring. He was inspired with our story. We thank God for that. So let me tell you another story whereby um, where every day when I leave work, uh, it's, uh, you know, in the bus, it's very hot. And when it gets hot, I sweat. And when I sweat, the sweat goes to the cracked part or the, the patches on my skin, the damaged part of my skin. And when it goes there, that means it's hell. It's scratching time. It's itchy time. I would use anything. I would use a pen. I would use, um, uh, uh, you know, I, I would use anything. I would use a nail cutter. I used to have a nail cutter. I would use a spoon. So there's this nail cutter that I even still have it right now. Uh, I used to scratch myself, no, no, not the sharp part, but the smoother part. I would scratch myself and I would feel very nice, nice but that was not enough. So my biggest wish was I just want to get home, remove my clothes, and go to my hot shower. <laughs> so when I get home, remove my clothes very slowly because it's sticky on my skin. Just remove it a little bit because it's very painful. And when I remove my trouser, just uh, as usual, dead skin would pour on the floor, a lot of them. Remove my t-shirt like that, and it's all dirty. All dirty, like a, a nursery school uh, <laughs> kid. So I would rush to the shower and open water to just burn my skin. And I would stand there for hours. I remember this day, I opened hot water for a long time, and then the steam, there was a lot of steam in that bathroom. And you know, when there's a lot of steam, the air disappears. When the air disappears, it, it means you don't have air. So I found myself uh, unconscious. Before actually, uh, I, I fainted. And uh, I fainted for a while. It's because, you know, m people just come to the bathroom, shower for, for about five, ten minutes, they're gone. And many people just want to go watch football. Other people have gone for dinner. Other people like going to the mall or, you know, just to the restaurants there and buy st some food. So I was just alone in the accommodation. You know, in that level, I was I was living in the first floor, and so nobody was there. My roommates were working night shift, so I'm just there, uh, uh, laying unconscious in the bathroom, and hot water was just pouring on my leg. The only thing that saved me it's the water that was pouring in uh, on my legs uh, that that uh, brought me up, at least, because I don't know what would have happened if the the, the water was not running. Because I really thank God, because I think the angels were watching over me, but. Believe me, hot water was another, uh, another thing that dried my skin so bad.